I say that these people can literally steal anything from Africa and go scot free with it. This is what I mean. <laughs> The song was actually written in 1986 by a Makosa group from Cameroon. So the song originally came from Cameroon, which is my country now. To me, you know, it came, it came to me to answer your question. Came to me in the most uh, unexpected way. I was actually, I was taking a, day, a few days off in, in my farm in, in Uruguay, and um, I, I walked from the barn to the house. And on that walk, boom, it came to me. I, I got the lyrics and the, and the music of the entire first verse and first pre-chorus. This time for Africa. <laughs> arrived to, to the house, I was like, I got it, 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 I know this is it. And, and, and I recorded it just with the guitar and, and, and voice, and that's how I realized uh, yeah. that the song was strong, you know? When, when a song sounds good just with a playing guitar and vocals, that's when, you know, you know that there's something there. And Shakira wrote this song in, on, in 2010 and she was claiming like it was just an inspiration that she got blah blah blah. Thinking of the fact that the actual writers of this song never got credit for it and YouTube at the point took this song down from YouTube and it just resurfaced like two or three years ago or maybe one two or three years ago. The original song has been in existence for 36 years and Shakira wrote her own part of that song like 10 or 12 years ago and she claims like or she got an inspiration that is one of the reasons why i was saying in one of my videos that africans are literally building this world but at the end of the day they get no credit for it